Hey guys, Dr. Pascal and Dr. Dan here with Lindenwoods Chiropractic. I'm sure you're all aware there's about 20 centimeters of snow that has fallen this morning. Very heavy wet snow. A number of people have already come into the office talking about lower back pain after having shoveled. So all we want to do today is show you a few do's and don'ts in terms of what to do and what to avoid doing. So first of all, Dr. Pascal is going to show us what not to do. So he's first of all using a straight shovel, which causes us to lift or the heavy part of the weights further away from us, which stresses the lower part of the back. On top of that, he's not bending his knees, causing him to lift from the hips. And then on top of that, he's lifting and twisting, which puts a ton of pressure and stress on the lower part of her back, and especially leading us to more disc injuries. So now what he's gonna use is what an ergonomic uh, shovel, which causes us to be to have the weight closer to our bodies. On top of that, he's gonna lift with his knees, and then also he's gonna just lift and push in front of him, not to twist to help lessen the stress on the lower part of the back. The other thing we could do is also use a scoop shovel, which causes us just to push the snow and lift right at the area. So hopefully this was helpful. Be careful shoveling. And if you're misfortunate enough to get hurt shoveling, make sure you see your local chiropractor to get checked out. Have a great day.